did my first chaos thing, my own tier 4 shredded me. Yeah, the tier 4s you've got to be careful with, especially with Cathay, because they are rocket launchers. The other tier 4s may not be quite as explosive. So the weaponry that's in the towers differs, and the stats the tower may differ. Um, certainly the looks are the same, and all of the barricade buildings are the same. Alright, uh, I think we are pretty much ready to go. Let's have you targeting their ranged guys. I embody the Emperor's will. Serve me and serve him. He shall reward victory. We obey. These guys are already low on leadership, which is interesting. Now that you're attacked, I'm just going to just blast these guys down with some lightning bolts. Lightning bolt! Oh, took too long to cast. We've got a bunch of them. We also have wind blast, which I think I'm just going to do diagonally across here. Sorry, guys. I'm going to kill the hounds. Which we did. They've broken. Okay, here comes the next wave. How are we looking on this side? They have not yet even reached us. Okay. I think we're going to be good. I think we're fine. Lords, harmony. My mind is ready. Let's get some lightning bolts. And I don't really care if these guys die. These garrison get those back automatically. Their entire job is basically just to hold their armies up so that my mage and my um, rocket launcher can do its damage. Oh, you guys are coming around the side. Interesting. Well, hopefully you three can put down some withering fire to kill those marauders. I somewhat suspect you probably can. Plus we can buff them. Oh, you know what? We can slow them. Right, they now move the next 27 seconds at a speed of 15. Oh dear. Now my gunners can just unleash hell, and they are. Jade warriors, march for the Emperor, Gairan's fury. Stone and steel. Okay, that was actually really powerful. <laughs> I like that a lot. Um, so their units have recovered. We are still fighting here, but that's going to be fine. I think you need to do one more lightning bolt there and then pull you back. Sheng Yang's people. A retreat! Or we the draw! Sheng Yang's people. Sun Yang's people. For the Emperor! Sheng Yang! Heal! Alright, get the magic going. Dragon crossbows! Alright, so the gunners and the crossbows have done a great job of just completely obliterating those guys. That's awesome. Now, we have a large number of enemies coming this way, so I think what I'm going to do is start beefing up the defences over on this side. I think I might even go for tier 2. The extra damage. And you and steel. better come over this side to help them. I think, frankly, the wizard My as well. Begins. I'll send you over there. Clear course. Crossbowmen. All right, Miao Ying is absolutely demolishing the Marauder Champion. That's good. That's what I was hoping to see. However, I think they did actually... No, they didn't. You guys are chasing there. Shattered. 
Dragon Guard! Right, you basically want to come over there nice and quickly. The Storm Dragon! Everything must die! Stone and steel! Right. What I'm going to do is back you lot up and reposition you on top of this just to make sure they don't take it. Miao Ying, you need to come over this side. Archers will be in range soon. We are still dealing with marauders here, and I'm amazed that you're not killed them yet. So let's do that and help them along. There we go, they've shattered. Magic is impressive. Alright, archers are firing. Praise the dragons! You two are going to be up against it for a little while until the reinforcements arrive. Uh, meanwhile, those guys have all shattered. However, the warhounds have not. So we're actually just going to move you back into the center just to make sure that they don't ninja that. Because that would very much be annoying. Artists. Harmonious roar! Master of Azir! Defend the realm! Guided by ancestors! There's Volley. Straight in the middle of them. God damn it, rocket launcher! Archer. My reinforcements. There they are. I am here, the gunners. Shall march in order the ranks. The celestial faithful. Understood. Send you over. As if the tower hasn't killed you. Warriors! Never conquered! Okay, these guys are definitely under a bit of threat there. Let's bring the gunners to here. Step marching as a one! Dragon crossbow! I think my rocket launcher is doing more damage to my units here Mistress than it is to them. Seeking Cathay's foes. Right, let's beef up their defenses. I am hail the gunners! Crossbowmen! The storm yeah, they wind just broke. Blows. It's not the spell I want. I want your spell. Ah, oh, you're still too far away. All right, now Ying. To Need to go after their general. Right now you're going to have free fall to shoot at that. For the defense. My power is absolute. Let's just slow them down so they can't get to me quite so quickly. Huzzah! All right, their general is running. Archers. Here comes the other mage, but we're running. So we still have magic. Can we cast this where it'd be most effective? It's actually you guys that are being attacked, so probably right about there. Right, 
Yep, that was a back <laughs> And there we go, victory is ours. Oh, that one especially. He's, he's a higher level than the others. And let's just drop another slow. It's definitely one of my favorite things to have emerged from the, uh, the Kislev playthrough. Knowing that you can use slow spells to uh, lock people out. We got the general. So that was good. And those guys are running too. Unsurprisingly. Did the archers survive? Praise the dragon! By celestial decree! Our master desert us! Fast, you move. 30. What's the 35. I was kind of hoping that we could fly over the top and then bomb them, but we never got the opportunity there. And the cavalry survived. Just confirmed this is a Vinch clone of Mordred, not the real thing. Did they both survive? Oh, they did. Ha. Huh. Mistress of Storms. I mean, I'm not actually sure if anything didn't survive. The storm unleashed. Did anything actually die? Um, no, I don't think they did. So the crossbows got 165 kills, the sky junk got 227, the astromancer got 117. Iron hail gunners, 36, 51. Peasant bows did 50, that's good. And they lost a thousand. We lost about 200, they lost a thousand. I just forgot about the supply, Shira. I'll be honest. I was too busy using magic. Because once we start getting our mages up to a decent level, magic can really turn the tide. And there we go. No losses. And they lost pretty much everything. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of experience. Level and a half. Nice. I think I might take the replenishment. Yeah, let's take the replenishment. <laughs> and then Welch of the Wolf Claw, you can see that he doesn't have a size thing. So you can see that there's no indicator on the side of his banner. And it's not a banner banner, it's just a shield. Which shows that that guy is a hero, he's not an army. Oh, Wolf, our enemy belonging to the Kurgan Warband, has perished in the Battle of Terracotta Graveyard. So has Niels. We gained an enchanted shield. Such a shield has been enchanted by a wizard, or blessed by a priest, to give its wearer greater protection. Ooh, legendary. The skull seeps a constant icy mist, concealing those who hold it. Missile resistance for all units in the army, and also vanguard deployment for that unit. Caravan completed. Blue Kiwi made it through, earning me 3,400 ducats. And every time you go to an end point for the very first time, you will get a legendary item from every city for the first time you arrive there. So we just got the Frostworm Skull because we arrived in... Erengrad? I think it was Erengrad. No, Frozen Landing. So we got the Frostworm Skull. Construct three buildings that contribute to harmony. And we'll get another Forbidden Rod if we do that. Cathayan faction should strive to maintain stability between the forces of yin and yang. Achieving balance leads to rewards, while extreme imbalances can cause unrest and other debilitating effects. The storm so, Miao Ying, you have now got access to all of this stuff, so 
Talent of the Knight is a Vortex spell that does do damage and doesn't move. Hmm. Regrowth is another heal, which includes a Vigor heal as well. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Earthing so I don't get the miscast fit for the dragon's quite so painfully. And then Garius is leveled up. We're going to take the second point in scooting a boot. And then I think yeah. that this army is just going to go and slap those armies down, to be quite honest. Yes. Storm Dragon. I auto resolve, low casualties, nothing dies. You face a dragon of Cathay. Losses. They have no other power Stone. When a magic user robs a power stone, the artifact glows for a split second before dulling forever. However, in that moment, the winds of magic blow into a tempest. Oh, this also adds more reserves. Nice. An assured assailant. Confidence can take you surprisingly far when assaulting the enemy. So our leadership aura size increases and leadership for our army when we're attacking increases. Cool. Great Bastion invader destroyed. So once again, the threat level goes down. And let's go and do it again. This time we would lose the cavalry if we auto resolved. So I think we'll probably go ahead and fight this one. They have a lot of throwing axes there. They'll have pretty significant ranged capabilities. Recommend sending the ca uh, caravan to Vlad's land. Vampires like trade too. Yeah, I do try to send the caravan to every available city at some point. The Skyjunk captain's definitely including friendly fire to bump up his rookie numbers. <laughs> Rad Rod Kimball, thank you very much for the subscription. Welcome to the Maudlings, good to have you joining us. Uh, CLK coming in with a 15 month resubscription, thank you very much for that CLK. Ergotism, thank you very much for the follow, and Handabertal, which I think I already said. Thank you also very much. Alright, so they're up. Oh man. <laughs> this is actually really good for us. Because, yeah, it's a terrace, which does mean that they have the height advantage. Fair enough. But they're in the wet terrace. This reduces their movement speed by 20%. Mistress of Storm. I have a lot of ranged units. Dragon Guard! Wind and fire! Kind of want you guys in as close as we can possibly get you. The Celestial Faithful! Iron Hills can go there, so I'm not entirely sure what they'll be able to hit. Because the Warriors. angle is a bit weird. Order and balance. We'll put our swordsman just behind. Yeah. You know, the Astromance. Oh man, I can slow them as well. <laughs> Store and steel. It is our sworn duty to defend Cathay on any front from which it is threatened. The Storm Dragon. So I can cast it once they get to that. do it when they get to about there. And slow. Dragon crossbow! 
shoot at him just to make sure he doesn't throw anything at me. And the gunners should be getting us pretty close. We might just be that general that gets through. You're shooting at me, so I'm going to put up my shield. Gonna stop you getting through. <laughs> this guy go down. Firing squad. Well, that worked. Uh, you know what? I kind of prefer if you just stuck around for a bit so I could get really sure that I could get killed, you know? And I'm pretty sure that army is dead now. Decisive victory. Done right it was. No losses. 219 kills. Oh, no. That unit's actually still quite strong. Bugger. They might actually survive. But it would literally just be that one unit, I think. So the rocket launcher got 80 kills. The dragon guard got 84. The gunners actually got 20 between them. I'm surprised that that many survived as far as they did. Did survive, bugger. The evil must be ah, they did. We're good. We did enough damage to the army as a whole. Featherfo Torque. The feathers of the many beasts dangle from this torque. Its enchantments allowing the wearer to strike its flying creatures with savage fury. So Featherfo Torque plus Pigeon Pluck a Pendant would make you incredibly strong against flyers. Rogue Hunter. Bandits, traitors, and outlaws are all cravens to the end, running in fear of the day that justice comes to claim their head. Lost five leadership against rogue armies. Kurgan's warband has been destroyed. We have another invader defeated. And with that, the Bastion threat's gone. We saw upon triumphant wings. But we're still going to move on to the gate, because I would like to rebuild that if I can. The storm dragon. Okay, Miao Ying, we can get magical reserves to get you some more magical power. I, think I was move. born to wield it. And we need a new caravan. So this caravan is going to spend several turns coming back home again. So what we're going to do is we are going to recruit a new one. We have a couple of options. So we have clandestine, which is the army experience per turn. Or we have another former artillery officer guess we'll go for the artillery officer. You can get some really interesting traits, like uh, Fan of the Empire, where you just get a bunch of Empire units, or Fan of Kislev, you get a bunch of Kislev units. It's one of the things I like about the caravans, so they can eventually become quite eclectic collections of units as they collect different units from the, the areas that they visit around the world, because there are events that do that as well. <laughs> 